Hi, my name is Bill, and I'm a um, traditional archer and bow hunter, and I uh, like to do 3D tournaments and things like that. And like many of you, I um, started out with wood arrows and, and then went to aluminum and thought I would never use carbon, didn't want anything to do with carbon arrows when they first came out, figured I would never use carbon, but um, as time goes on and I realized that some of the new carbons that were coming out were really flying well off of my friend's traditional bows and I thought I'd give them a try and I don't think I'll ever go back to aluminum, that's for sure. I still love my woods, but aluminum, uh, the constant worry about whether they're bent whether they're straight, um, you know, wondering if you're going to damage them when you bounce it off of something hard. Uh, you just don't have that with carbon. It's either, either perfect or it's broken. Um, and that is an amazing relief on a 3D tournament, not having to worry uh, if your arrow has a bend in it that you haven't noticed. So, I'm cheap, and when carbon shafts are expensive, and I didn't want to uh, break them and and you know the you know as well as I that the real flaw of carbon arrows is the ends um, they're they, they flex beautifully and don't splinter this way but uh, a strike on the knock end uh, or a strike on this end driving the point in the insert back can splinter the shafts and I found out that you can foot carbons with aluminum shafting to uh, help prevent that from happening so with some trial and error, I figured out how to do that, and I thought I'd put together a video showing you my technique for footing uh, carbon arrows. Um, as an example, here's a 3555 gold tip, one of the set I just made for my son, and uh, it's the, um, uh, the traditional uh, wood grain, um, and it's footed with a piece of Eastern aluminum arrow right here and at the knock end as well. Um, so I wanted to show you my technique for putting these aluminum foots on, feet, foots, feet, these aluminum footings on to uh, help make this arrow last and last and last.